zo volgen die hier. Film van Woody Allen speelde Sweden Lowdown, ik weet niet of je het gezien hebt. En uh, Howard, maybe you can tell a little bit how that uh, went. I thought, I, I thought you'd never ask. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you guys don't have to go anywhere for a while. No, no actually, it was, it was an amazing opportunity. I got a call from Dick Hyman, who is a great piano player and also Woody's musical director for many years, who I played with a lot of the years. He called me one morning and said, Howard, in this very businessman, drive-like way, he said, Howard, it's Dick Hyman. Oh, hi, Dick. Howard, can you play guitar exactly like Django Reinhardt? I said, of course, Dick. I my top liver. <laughs> yeah. so, well, Woody's next film is, see, Woody gives very little information about his projects in advance, but he says, Woody's out, next film is all about Django Reinhardt. I said, well, I've been listening to Django Reinhardt since I was 12 years old, and he's a major part of my musical makeup, so, yeah, I think I can do a convincing job. And uh, later that week, I went by to meet the producer of the film and introduced myself and just wanted to kind of check me out. And, and in a matter of minutes, he says, would you consider teaching our star how to play guitar? And I said, well, who's your star? And he said, Sean Dan, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And it involved canceling quite a few engagements for the summer, but it, it involved basically flying out to San Francisco once a week for several weeks, spending a couple of days with Sean Penn, and just starting from scratch with him, and uh, also traveling over to Italy while, while Sean was filming another movie. He was so serious about it, he wanted to keep working on the guitar on every spare moment, like on his lunch breaks. So, so, so we're in, uh, in Florence, Italy, while he's filming this other movie. And uh, I was at, up to that point, I'd been working with him on very nonsensical stuff, just strictly to get his hands on the guitar, you know. Stuff like that, <laughs> and uh, very serious. But one night, after after he spent a whole day on the set, I made a major breakthrough and got him to play this much of a tune. <laughs> lunch break. He says, well, you know that thing you showed me last night? He said, yeah. He said, after you left, I played it over and over again for eight hours and my fingers are kind of sore. <laughs> so this is the kind of dedication he had. I wish I, I, wish I was that serious about playing a guitar. <laughs> anyway, it was, it was a fun project. He, he, what he learned on the guitar far exceeded, what, you know, one day on the set, Woody's, Woody came by and we were playing again. Sean was doing this on the guitar. Sean, you're not actually playing that, are you? <laughs> well, I, I don't understand. I didn't tell you you had to actually learn how to play the guitar. I just wanted you to look like you knew what you're doing. I, how, how is this possible? Yeah, you know. <laughs> yeah. so, what do you think we've been doing for the past four months? So. <laughs> Anyhow, are you still awake? <laughs> oh. Anyhow, it was, it, was a fun, it was a fascinating six months. Also, I'll play it here. I'll hear what it is. <laughs>
Thank mm -hmm. you. 